This could get disgusting very soon if Joe can move in quickly. Mommy pushes in to take out everyone. That just happened. This is to tie the game. Welcome to another matchup on Zero Hour in the Zero Cup. We have Team Plain Eagle versus Team Robin Sage. For Team Plain Eagle, we have High Dad, Later Rusty, Pot, Zcot, and Eighth. For Team Robin Sage, we have Robin Sage, Wheeze, Mike Crook, and Abop. Right now, your leader is Zcot. Zcot with 187 Deploying in 10 elo seconds. points. Robin Sage, team captain on the other side, is 91 points on in fourth place. 91 points. We have Abop with Located the Mac 10 and armor. We have Wheeze with the MP7 and armor as well. Robin Sage with the MP7, going with the wedge. Mike Cook. He's going to have the AK and armor. Eighth coming in with the Mac 10 on the assaulting team. Zcot with the frag will repel up the balcony. Hi Dad also choosing the balcony with the M4 though. Later Rusty Pot using the oppressor and a frag. For the defenders, they will choose to do room 302 on the top floor. And looks like Zcot will go ahead and peek that balcony. To check if anyone is in there. That is Abop in the bathroom. Robin Sage is set up across the hall, trying to get into a good position to support if needed. Robin Sage will get a peek of Zcot on the balcony. Popping shots, but not hitting. Zcot will dance on the balcony trying to get a hit on Robin Sage. Robin Sage not peeking out. Mike Crook takes out later Rusty Pot. Robin Sage will wait. Zcot will throw a nade over. Robin Sage throws a nade that doesn't quite reach. Zcot will bait with the defuse. I don't think anyone even heard it though. He probably could have gotten away with it, honestly. Weez and Abop are watching in the lobbies. Some stair activity going on. Robin Sage pushes in on the objective as Zcot is taking out the bomb, and he does successfully defuse the bomb with everyone alive. With the exception of. I think that was Mike Crook who died. No, sorry, Mike Crook was the one who took out later Rusty Pot. Imagine that. Nearly everyone alive getting the defuse. That is about as ninja as you can get. Mike Crook with the first kill and only kill of that match, doing 155 damage. Look at that, for all that fire back and forth between Zcot and Robin Sage, no damage at all. They had sights on each other and nothing to show for it, except for a win. Robin Sage will start with the MP7 Deploying and a wedge. For Wheeze, he will have the MP7 and armor. Abop, Mac 10 and a frag. And for Mike Crook, the AK, he will also be setting up a frag Locate and defuse the bomb. at the end of the hall. For High Dad, it's going to be a frag. Eighth is coming in right in the front door with the scar. He's going to play the long game. I actually will reconsider that possibly. Yes, he's going to jump back off. Zcot coming in with a frag and later Rusty Pot also using a frag, but will use the tactical shotgun. You will have to get in your face with that. Not sure what Eighth is considering or reconsidering out there in the front. Zcot's going to play the balcony again. Is Robin Sage going to be ready for it? And Zcot takes out Wheeze. That is, Robin Sage is there and watches Wheeze die right in front of him. 
Hey, Bob, in the bathroom. Robin Sage taking shots at the balcony wide of Zcot. A Bob is going to inch out a little bit outside the bathroom. He's probably in the better position to take out Zcot. Zcot now joined by later Rusty Pot. Later Rusty Pot will be first on the ground. Coming in, sees the restroom taking out A Pop. Robin Sage will close nope. Close in on them a little bit downhill to kind of take out mostly. Zcot fragging. Mike Crook takes out A. Zcot takes out Robin Sage with that frag. And Mike Crook will be on his own to defend All against enemies have been neutralized. Team Plain Eagle. But Zcot finished the job once again, securing another point for Team Plain Eagle. After two rounds, Zcot with three kills that time. And later Rusty Pot with one. Zcot on the defuse in the last round. And Mike Crook will have two kills in this match. Use the planning table Team Robin Sage off. might need to take out the trainer bullets. As Weez will start with the AK-47 and the frag. Abop with the MP7 and a sticky cam, finding a good position for that. Robin Sage has the MAC-10 and Deploying the wedge. Seconds. Mike Crook with the AK-47 and a frag. They will set up on the same floor. But maybe try a new defense. Located Actually, correction, is that the lower floor? I believe that's on the lower floor. Yes, they went third floor this time, not fourth floor. Eighth is going to go up and... I was right initially, the fourth floor. Eighth is going to go ahead and take on um, the long game on um, the entrance to peek out here. Does not see Robin Sage on the ground. And just like that, the attacking team will have to go in blind without sights in the long haul. Rusty Pot checking the second floor. Hi, Dad. Continuing to climb up to the third. Zcot now on the objective level. Checking the room 302 from room 304, making sure it's clear. Wheeze. He will spot Zcot if he keeps his eyes down the hall. Robin Sage will move in to room 301 and seeing if he can get some sights better than where he's been at. Hi, Dad. Coming in from down below. Rusty Pot is going to have to work his way up. Zcot, the only one on the objective floor against the entire opposing team. My dad will come down the stairs. Zcot, dropping down on the third floor, will enter that way. Robin Sage not looking to get swept. They are just going to hold the position and wait for the match to come to them. Zcot spots his friendly on there. Hi, Dad. Kicks open the door. That'll alert them. That is Mike Crook who gets alerted. Door and maybe get some hits. Hi, Dad with 48 health left. Mike Crook watching the door that Zcot is coming up now. And he's not sure where to look at this moment. Zcot will take down Robin Sage and Mike Crook from across the hall. Rusty Pot at the door. Zcot at his door. He's waiting for anyone to enter. Abop coming out to take out Rusty Pot. Oh, sorry, actually, Rusty Pot goes down by Weez. Hi, Dad takes the same out by Weez. And Zcot gets taken down by Weez. Weez with three kills in a row to finish that round. And. We have Robin Sage with one kill, Mike Crook with two kills. Wee's getting all three of his kills from that last round. We are no longer looking at a single carry here as they're now starting to maybe get the unison going. Use the planning team to find the bomb. The other story is it's all Zcot. Eighth is going to come in with the AK-47 and the frag. Hi, Dad has the MP7. He will wedge a door. Zcot going in 10 seconds. Open the doors for the top floor entry. As he waits with armor, he might be roaming or playing a bit more aggressively. Rusty Located Pot has the, the wedge and AK-47 or 74. Actually, I'm not even sure which one that is. 
Oh, this time we've just been saying AK. The assaulting team not going in unison, but mostly at the main entrance. Robin Sage is going to be the outlier going up the balcony side. At least he'll look at it for a little while while his stamina com comes up. Hey, Bob, going to the balcony. Wheeze. Looking up. Wants to make sure no one's going to pick him off while he's dangling. Looking into 304 and 302 on the other side. Hi, Dad. Ready and waiting. Here's the glass break. And that's all the information he needs to hunt down and get taken out by Wheeze. Zcot is now in position. Move in. And Wheeze will take out Rusty Pot. Zcot on the door. Gets enough of Apop to take him out. Wheeze hunkers down. Eighth takes out Mike Foot. It is now 2v2. Wheeze looking into 302 while Robin Sage looks to towards the hall doors. Eighth. Wondering where all the action's at. Zcot. 302. Just peeking. Wheeze does not want to be a hero with only 30 health. Robin Sage is gonna get on the floor. And we have just over two minutes left, about 220. Wheeze and Robin Sage have an escape route. They want to go up the balcony, but they are going to choose to stay here. Wheeze goes to frag out. That may be the perfect position to take out Zcot. Oh, it does not. Let's go ahead and spam the door. The Zcot's coming on. Left door, not really much of an option with it being wedged. Out. The whole team is here. Zcot. Seven health left. He's not going to be much health if he keeps going aggressively. Eighth is going to have to come in here and do something to help out Zcot. Eighth is dancing on the door. Looks like Zcot might work the wedge as Weez and Robin Sage play outside. Zcot's going to push in and just start shooting. And gets taken out by Robin Sage. Seven health. Eighth will, will take out Robin Sage. We're getting in here and taking out Wheeze. He will finish it off for Plain Eagle. That's the push Team Plain Eagle needed to get out of that one. Honestly, Team Robin Sage could have retreated or something when that plan was not working. I mean, they basically made themselves in a corner by insisting on being in 304 and 302. And Wheeze, Robin Sage, Mike, Crook, all getting kills, all doing significant damage. Abop in the He's rear, the planning table to find the bomb. still doing enough damage to at least have taken out one, had all of it been, de been dealt on the same person. For Team Plain Eagle, Zcot, six kills for the match. Eighth Deploying with three. Ten seconds. Nice push in the end there. Get him up on the board and in positive KD. Later, Rusty Pot. Helping Located out the best he can. Bomb. Up to now. But we will see how he does in round two of the defense. Looks like Rusty Pot will take the hall. Hi, Dad. Waiting for anyone who dares to go up that front entrance. All of Team Robin Sage taking the balcony side. Hi, Dad will be disappointed. Rusty Pot is ready. Eighth is ready. And Mike Crook does significant damage there on Rusty Pot with 27 health left. Ooh, does not expect the approach on the right side. And now the defense has awoken. Like a bop will take out eighth. Mike Crook will take out later. Zcot was sitting back in the kitchen with his armor. Will push up now. Suspect something's going on on the left. That repel drop, but now back up. 
Oh, that might have been a headshot. If only it was a little tiny bit higher. 68 health left on Mike Crook. Mike Crook will just unload on that location. And High Dad will take out Mike Crook. Robin Sage takes out High Dad. Wheeze and Sa Robin Sage are there against. Oh, Zcot taken out. Wheeze. It is now Robin Sage and Zcot left. It is interesting to see how. Oh, Robin Sage is going to play with the bomb. I don't think Zcot even had a clue that that was going on. All enemies have been neutralized. And Zcot will take out Robin Sage as Robin Sage lets go of the bomb. For the defense, they will go ahead and successfully defend on the back of Zcot. Look at that, nearly a thousand damage. Eighth doing another significant amount of damage there. Later, Resty Pot also close by. But Zcot mainly finishing He's the job. Table to find the bomb. For the attacking team, well, so far, only one person on Team Robin Sage has a positive KD, and that will be Wheeze. Deploying in 10 seconds. Eighth with the MP7. Hi, Dad. He's gonna run around with the flare. Zcot also with the flare. Locate and Crook has the disconnected. You'll see if that matters. Later, Rusty Pot with the MP7 and a flare. It's kind of a odd timing, all of them choosing the flare. Robin Sage, Mac 10, A Pop, Scar, Wheeze, M4. Oh, that balcony has someone waiting there. And Wheeze will just climb up without checking first, and Zcot will be ready to take him out. We have Abop and Robin Sage on the balcony. Only two alive on Team Robin Sage. That third one is a misdirection from the reconnect by Mike Crook. Eighth, peeking the hall. Robin Sage now in the lobby, hiding behind the vending machine. That is information for High Dad, as well as Rusty Pot. That flare, oh so bright. Another frag will go down there, but no one is there. Team Plain Eagle in good cover. Hi Dad takes out Robin Sage. With a frag. <laughs> Taking out Eighth. As Eighth got too excited by the activity in the hall, exposing himself. Hi Dad and Rusty Pot. They will have to defend. Against a Ooh, snaps to Rusty Pot, but Rusty Pot is just that much better. That is the match. Team, Team Plain Eagle will take it. 5-1 with Zcot. Whew. I mean, how can you not win with getting 9 kills there and nearly 1,200 damage?